In this video, I'm going to be talking about printing in NinjaFlex on your Ultimaker 2 3D printer. NinjaFlex is basically a fully flexible 3D printing filament, which is really quite strong, as you can see. It's pretty stretchy, uh, and you can produce loads of cool different things. Uh, if you're looking to print things like phone cases, for example, this one here, just quite cool. And also, we've done done things like this, so this is a, like a map, and you can stretch it, screw it up, and it returns to its original shape, and this octopus as well is quite cool, and we've got another video where we run over it in the car, and this, just to prove the strength really, it really is tough stuff, but very flexible at the same time, which is great. So there's a few things that you might, there's a few settings that you might want to change um, when printing with this. Firstly, you want to slow the, slow the speed down to about 20 millimeters per second. We found this works best, really. Any faster, and you might get a few issues. Um, things like this could happen. In the, uh, in the feeder at the back, you might get tangled up. So you, and you want to avoid that, obviously, for <laughs> plenty of reasons. Still not that happening. And the other thing is raising the temperature. So printing with PLA, you might, you're probably printing at 210. With this, I'd recommend about 230 degrees, and that should see you being able to print some really cool stuff. Um, if you're interested in this product, we sell it at dream3d.co.uk, and it's available in lots of cool colours, and also a semi-flexible version as well, so you should definitely check that out. Thanks for watching. If you like the video, then please click to subscribe. For more information on the printers and materials we've used in this video, visit dream3d.co.uk.